Please select a mission. Mission accepted. Mission not accepted. Mission accepted. Soviet commanders are meeting at Davialo Calais. The mission is to eliminate all three. How you do it is up to you, boss. Good luck. I've sent the target's anticipated travel routes and the meeting location to your map. Take a look. Detected. The map has been updated. Enemy presence detected. The map analysis complete. Analysis complete. Analysis complete. Guard post captured. Arrived at Mother Base. Enemy presence detected. The map has been updated.
good look at their faces so we can ID the targets. Analysis complete. You have arrived at your destination. Detected. The map has been updated. The map has been updated. Analysis. The map has been updated. Added. Development project has been added. Mission complete. Great work. Ocelot got the details of the meeting out of that commander. It seems you've been doing your job just a little too well, boss. The Soviets have begun reinforcing the 40th Army's units in Afghanistan. Sending in more men, and new equipment. 
While things haven't exactly been easy for us up till now, they're about to get even tougher. More staff from each of the teams are active in the area of operations now. That means some will be wounded, get sick, or suffer PTSD. That's where the medical team comes in. I've taken the liberty of commissioning the construction of a new medical platform. Having proper medical facilities for the men is a matter of life or death, so I put up the resources this time around. You can check on the platform's progress by selecting base facilities under the iDroid's mother base menu. Psydops list updated. Members of the intel team are on the ground. Mission list Their updated. reports will be reflected as predicted enemy fields of movement on your iDroid's map. The higher the team's level, the more accurate and frequent their reports will become. Be sure to take advantage of them. Unit function added. Development project has been added. Please specify a project. Assigned. Staff assigned. Unit function added. Development project has been added. Please specify a project. Please specify a project. Please specify a project. Please specify a project. Please select a mission. Marker placed. team analyzed the honeybee. How? The CIA wanted it with everything intact. They took it apart to look at it. Then they put it back together. Everything intact. <laughs> That's the R&D boys, all right. Turns out the honeybee's homing capabilities are a cut above previous manpads. It can detect a broad range of infrared wavelengths and even ultraviolet for supplementary guidance. Hence the name, huh? Right. Honeybees rely on UV light to fly. With this device, flares don't do the target any good. That's why the Soviets are losing so many gunships. And why the CIA was so desperate to get it back. It wasn't just about preventing the Soviets from devising countermeasures. What if the likes of Iran got their hands on it? American aircraft would be put at risk too. We can use this tech to develop our own portable missile. That'll give us a huge advantage. It'll take a little time before the analysis results. The security forces must know something about the targets. After you grab or hold up an enemy, try interrogating them.
analysis complete. Analysis complete. Updated. Analysis complete. Just what we need to develop new weapons and equipment. Mother base. Marker placed. Please select a mission. to get our hands on that cyborg arm developer. There's no one in Diamond Dogs who can so much as maintain that thing. Bionic arm, not cyborg, if you go by what he calls it. But you're right, the East is light years ahead in bionics. They can even detect through the skin the slight electrical signals from the brain that order muscles to move. The Soviet Union completed their first bionic arm capable of doing that back in the 60s. Although I guess that news didn't really reach the West. No kidding. Zdornovs was the only one I ever saw. Quite a shock to see it for the first time. And it was no mean feat to get hold of Snake's arm. I couldn't get one for you at the time, but you know, now... It... Forget it. I've no intention of relying on bionics. Right now I need to keep the pain fresh in my mind. Well, it's your decision. But don't... Inconvenient. 
mind? Not a bit. But the phantom pain. It never lets up. Do you know how many men I saw die that day? There's nothing we can do to bring them back. And you expect me to care about getting a measly arm and leg back? <sighs> Sorry. But my pain belongs to all our dead comrades. I'll keep living with it for their sake. It'll guide me straight and true until I've gotten them the vengeance they deserve. Diamond Dog's intel team specializes in information gathering, mainly human and SIGINT. They plant scouts and moles in the field. These operatives will blend into the local populace and work under the guise of a resident, or disguise themselves as travelers and ask around for information. They observe targets using various hidden bugs, cameras, and transmitters, and by tapping their satellite and phone communications. Analyzing all this information creates a clear picture of how wars and the PFs fighting them are changing. This data can also be used for threat assessment when deciding whether to accept contracts from certain clients. And during missions, the intel team keeps track of target locations and produces FOM predictions. Reporting mission critical information based on real-time remote observation of changes in the AO. What you hear from us over the radio is based on how we interpret the data gathered at the command platform. However, intel team operatives go unarmed in almost all situations to avoid revealing themselves to the enemy. Some will carry a knife, but most have nothing at all. As such, don't expect them to help you take on heavily armed adversaries like PF soldiers. Think of them as entirely passive in the hot zone. Plus, they use all manner of techniques to remain inconspicuous in the field. If you ever spot one, you'll have some serious explaining to do. So remember, their specialty is espionage. They may not be of use in a firefight, but when it comes to intel, they're pros.
clouds approaching. Boss, this is important. We have reports of a cracked sniper at large in the Afghan wilderness. The Soviets call this sniper T. Quiet. There are never any sightings, and only corpses are left behind. The Soviets have already lost a number of officers. You, uh, best watch your step. Destination. Enemy presence detected. The map has been updated. Analysis. That's the target. Is that one of our men from nine years ago? Bring him home, boss. Arrived at Mother Base. 